So I'm here at Hertz Donut. It's out here in Katy. It's the second in Texas. And this place, y'all, I walked in and my head went like off my neck. Um, I'm here with Matt Whitney, you're the owner, and i um, so excited to have you guys here in Houston. Um, it is not your average donut store. Definitely not. Right? Sure. The cool thing about these donuts is they're twice as large as your the regular donuts. But then beyond that, it's uh, everything is fresh, so if nothing comes in frozen on a truck or we thaw anything out, it's all handmade here right in the store. Right now, we're going to uh, do a little demo of your number one seller, the Jesus Donut. That's great. Right? Okay, so we're starting right over here with the dough, right? That's correct. So this is a vanilla cake donut. It's the base for this donut, which is called our Jesus. There we let it rest for 10 minutes, and then once it's done resting, then we take it over to the hopper and uh, get it ready to go. That's right, the hopper. Yeah. Woo! With them all, there you go. And we might need a little more practice, but I'd say for your first time, you know, it's not too bad. So it's a vanilla cake donut. And then we're going to ice it with vanilla icing. Then we have a cinnamon and sugar mixture that we'll actually put on top of the vanilla icing and then we'll drizzle it with uh, okay. caramel. Pick it up kind of by the edge of it okay. and bring it over to the icing. And then you just give it a big kind of plop and then just grab it by the edges, lift it straight up. Ooh. And then you go straight into the cinnamon and sugar. <laughs> That's good, and you just pull it up and set it oh down. Oh my gosh, that looks so good! Yeah, and then our final step, we're just gonna pipe the caramel onto the donut. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna get this extra, um, extra little light with the icing. Vanilla, yeah. Icing. Taste test. We're yes. gonna do a little taste test. Um, so we have some of the, the favorites here. I'm gonna try, what's this one here? So that is peanut butter Oreo. Oh my God, peanut butter Oreo. Okay, I'm back in there when you're done. Okay, yeah. It's not gonna hurt my feelings. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look. We never stopped making them. You know, we've got a great staff. We hired initially over 90 people, and so they're here all the time, and uh, oftentimes Lane and myself are always yeah. here with them. So. Yeah. Uh, we work hard, but uh, we're having a fun time doing it, and uh, I've really had a great response from the community here in Katy. So yeah, what have you heard? Like, when people walk in, like, right. people just go, oh. You know, oftentimes it's, the line kind of gets held up initially because people haven't been here before, yeah. and so they're just sitting there just, like, looking at the case of just all the 70-plus varieties that we've got trying to make up their minds what they want. Well, here's the good thing. Have y'all ever gone to a place and then you end up doing that panic order and you just panic and so you just order something and then you get it and you're like, here, not a problem. You can panic order and you're going to love everything, right? Yeah. Hey, buddy. Hey, how's come, it going? Come here often? Every day. <laughs> That's what I heard. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so you come here every day. Yep. Um, so what, this must be your fave? Yes, maple bacon. Do you get that every day? Every day. I might pick up a couple things for, for the kids and wife, but make make we'll bake it for, for myself. For the kids. No. Rude. I mean, poor guy. I think he thought I was going to try to eat a cinnamon. I think he did. <laughs> Bacon's not so much my thing, but what is my thing is this Nutella donut. This was actually made by BuzzFeed. So one, of, one of 33 must-tried donuts before you die. So what, I mean, is this what, Nutella in the middle? So, so I, do I need to go straight to the middle? Yeah, I mean, I, I definitely go for it. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. So that is a, so good. Yeah, it's a, a yeast donut mm -hmm. that we, once it comes out of the fryer, we dust it in cinnamon and sugar. Okay. Uh, and then we fill it with our Nutella filling. Other than, you know, you've got some like memorabilia stuff, like some t-shirts yeah. and some cool stuff too. And you'll have a lot of charitable work. We do. Yeah. So uh, you'll notice over here of our uh, our water bottles uh, and our uh, water refrigerator. So 50 cents of every do every uh, water bottle that we sell, we actually donate that back to the MS Society. Uh, so so that, and then you mentioned our T-shirts. Uh, our T-shirts are basically a wearable coupon. They're buy one get one free for life. So as long as you have it on, whenever you come into the store, you can just walk up and buy a donut and you get another donut for free for as long as you live in the Hertz donut. I love that. Tell me about the name. Uh, you want a Hertz donut, don't you? Uh, yeah. Hertz donut. Hertz donut. I 
Why didn't I think of that? Right. Um, I've got a joke for you. Okay. What kind of donuts lie? Oh, um, I don't know. Donuts lie. Plain donuts. Oh, wow. <laughs> Very funny. That's funny. That's super funny. <laughs> All right, guys, you have to try it. Um, like I said, it's out here in Katy, but um, definitely worth the drive if you're not in the immediate area. They're open uh, 365 days a year. Definitely a destination you want to come out. What's your favorite? Uh, I have several. I'm kind of a, a classic guy, so I like the uh, old fashioned and the blueberry that we tried a little earlier. Today. Okay, so this one right here. Okay, well, and now I gotta try this one too. So this is what I think is great. Travis, one of our producers in the office, he's doing a whole 30 right now. Well, guess what, Travis? And I'm a still joke from Frank. I'm doing the whole 30 too. I'm gonna eat all of these donuts, all 30 of them. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> you can have it. We've got more than 30 if you want to try. Okay. For more information on her.